Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. Your boy Looney here. And today we are getting into Puss in Boots, The Last Wish. I love the first Puss in Boots. Um, I haven't seen that movie in, damn, probably like, oof, maybe since a year or two after it came out. So I was shocked that this movie got made. So they made a sequel. It took forever. I don't know what took them so long, but it took forever. But we're going to go ahead and get into this one because really, I've heard good things about it. And I'm curious to see what's going on in it. Now, I'm wondering if we're going to get any Donkey or Shrek cameo. None of them were in the first one that I can recall. But then again, I haven't seen the movie in over a decade, maybe. So that's going to be interesting to see. I'm curious to see what happens here. I'm curious to see if the Egg Dude shows back up. Um, I think that was Zach Galifianakis who did it in the first one. So that's going to be interesting to see. But before we get into this uh, video, just want to remind y'all to don't forget to like, share the video, comment, and subscribe because subscribing is free. Costs you nothing. Helps me a lot. Costs you not a penny. But uh, other than that, let's just go ahead and get into this movie and see what they got in store for us. And once again, as we watch Puss in Boots, The Last Wish. Let me see what y'all got for me now. Beautiful colors right there. Starlight, star bright. Talk to me, Hawk. Star I see tonight. Uh huh. I wish I may. I wish I might have this wish. I wish tonight. It's slightly a prayer I used to do when I was a child. Oh, this story is a fairy tale. Once okay. upon a time, a wishing star fell from the sky. I'm not gonna lie, for a minute, it reminded me of the, uh, the more you know. The dark forest was born. Mm. The wishing star hitting at its center, filling it with new life. Okay. And the legend of a single wish locked away in the star, waiting to be granted. Okay. I like that setup. Come on, like, Puss is always... This animation style is crazy. I see her. Yo, he walked over that child's face. Yes. Yes. Play a song. No, no, no. Play a song. Who is your favorite fearless hero? Who is so unbelievably humble? The puss is not humble in any way, shape, or form. I used to do that with butter knives when I was a kid. My mom hated it. Mm. He's getting his rubber dance on. What the hell? Oh, okay. Who just showed up? Yo. Oh, what's up, dude? Look at his hair. My clothes. My clothes. My wig. My wig. My portrait. You know what I mean? Looks better now. Oh, that's the what governor. We got a problem. Ooh, 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 he, that old bitch is ruined. Uh, uh, I'm loving the motions right now. Damn. Take that L. Oh. Never been touched? Ooh, ooh. Yo, when did he have time to do all that? Yo, he just let him match with his teeth. <laughs> uh, that's how my climax looks. What the hell? That is funny. Dog piles don't work on cats. The sleeping giant of Delmar? What's wrong with this child? No, no, no. Then let him die. No, no. No. Oh. Hmm. And the rest of you play double time. The animation is so weird. It like it has a little bit of a claymation vibe to it. Ooh. Funny mm. splinter. Yo, he legit threw him. Yo, this... He is so lucky. 
Oh no. What did this cat just trick? If you dare. Ooh. Dude just chucked a bell. He's using a bell like a nunchuck. This is gorgeous. He literally blinded him with the one eye he had. Oh no, is that gonna pop him? Something cool. Mmm. Yo. I don't know if you can make a harder intro for a hero. Are we serious? That was almost on some God of War. I'll tell you this. If there's one thing I learned from Coco, you never stand under a bell. The legend will never die. Ooh, ooh. Oh, temperature. Oh. Now your tail and relax. Oh. What? Trust me. That's how you take care of temperatures? You died. Again, dog. No. I am a cat. I have nine lives. And how many times have you died already? Huh? That's, that's, that's blatantly one. Do you like gazpacho? <laughs> it was gazpacho, yeah. You know? never had it, it? fellas. <laughs> oh, yeah, you was tripping. Uh, excuse me, does this have shellfish in it? Yes, sir. Yeah. <laughs> this, this dude. Oh, there goes my dude. Master of the baking. What? Do you know the Muffin Man? The Muffin Man. No more adventures. Retirement. You need to retire. Me? Retire? Are you the village comedian as well? Yo, the way they animated comedian. Any special someone you can rely on in this moment of need? Barber's orders. I mean, doctor's orders. How are you going to be a barber with your hair looking like that? You really got to work on your bedside manner. He's gonna take that whole fucking bottle, isn't he? Yeah. I don't blame him. You don't tell me I gotta retire and not give me a retirement gift. Calling the milk cream. What the hell? Retire. You are too good looking. Why did retire. the wind just blow out the fire? What? Hell no. Hell no. I feel like Puss is in danger. Thanks. Why is his eyes Good bloodshot to red? You, too. See, Puss's eyes are glowing green. His are bloodshot hey, red. I never do. Autograph. I've been following you for a long time. Sign right there. Oh, he wants beef. <laughs> Everyone thinks you'll be the one to defeat me. Who are you? But no one's escaped me yet. Uh, Sounds boring. All right. Let's get it over with. Spare me if you dare. Oh, we got a problem. No more messing around. All right, let him know, boys. Let him know. We got a problem. Oh, oh! Did he catch his hair? Ooh. Okay. Okay. The spin will jiggle. Oh. You could have broke his neck right there. I. Fear he should retire. Ooh. And he dropped his blade, yo. He made him bleed. Should have known when he said at the beginning of the movie. Oh, he's scared. Oh shit. I just love the smell of fear. Yo. This dude is a demon. His whole life flashing before his eyes. Get out of there. Lives flashing before your eyes. Damn. Pick it up. Oh no. Oh no. Corre, corre, gatito. Hmm. Did he go down the toilet? That's how you know he was terrified. If you ever flush yourself down a toilet, you know whatever is outside of that toilet is going to kill you. Bearing for some boots. We are gathered here today. Of course, to he's gonna make it to super goddamn. There are no words to express such a loss. Uh, what? Thank you. <laughs> Did you see the animation in the movements? That was amazing. 
Stubby Tubby. Ooh, look at that. Gato. Yeah, yeah, yeah. To some, an outlaw. To uh, more, a hero. Mm -hmm. To all, a legend. Indeed. I was right. Words were not enough. But you did your best. <laughs> That's definitely how my cat looks. I told you health department. Oh, this is a black lady. You can hear that. Uh-huh. Uh, <clears throat> you can hear that black lady. Get you inside because baby, they are always. I didn't know he was gonna go to Frederick Douglass's mother. Forever. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Be concerned. Why is she in the tub with him? I'll call you. Oh, no. Brother cats, sister kitties, meet your new roommate. <laughs> All these cats look like they're going to try to kill them. No. Orange cat? No. Oh. Oh, 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 oh. He's Did back. Something salty? That was Did my I favorite cat in the first one. I'm sorry. I mean, this is a person party, Pickle. That's your party. I'll be damned. So this is where dignity goes to die. Indeed. You can hear these other cats talk. <laughs> That's me at McDonald's. Oh no, he did it. He did it. It's alright, dog. No. <laughs> no, bruh. These are too small. And these are too big. Dramatically. But these ones. These ones are just right. Is that Bo Peep? Oh, Goldilocks? Why did I say Bo Peep? Yo, it's always crazy how they turn the simplest nursery rhymes into some of the most vicious people. Just get beat down. Like, what is up with your tail? Do you mind trying to eat here? I mean, meow, whatever. Oh, sorry. <laughs> I want this. I want this. Uh, I want this okay, cat away from me. Oh, oh, hang on. Who are you touching? Pickles? Is that your name? Me? I don't have a name or a home. So, so how are you I'm in no here? expert, but you don't look like a cat. I'm talking about you look like a dog. Okay, okay, okay. Full disclosure, I'm not a cat. Uh, I'm clearly, a dog. Obviously. Looking at that was your story. It's over. Yeah, you oh, got no. that ass tattooed. Want to rub my belly? No. Hmm? Ugh. What? What's happening? Rub. Hard buzz. Come on. Yeah. I'm gonna be a therapy dog someday. What the hell are you talking about? The only I'm therapy you you'll do is for a blind bad. person who can't see. It'll make him feel better. And it knows no. that person who can't no. smell rub what you must no. think like. Let me be clear. So, what do you want? I want <laughs> to be left alone. The pose he said, yo. My cat does poses like that. Did he follow you there? The wolf he found me. Hell no, that's a goddamn bear. Oh, did the bear just grab the black lady? Looking for a cat. This cat. We've got an offer for him. What could they possibly want to offer Puss in Boots? What's a Puss in Boots? Seriously? Just don't hurt the old lady. Oh, no. Excuse me, my darling. Uh, We're looking for the lady that was good. Puss in Boots. Have you perhaps Ooh. seen him? Too soft. Out with it, you old biddy, or I'll have your guts for garters. <laughs> Too hard. That was not... <laughs> Just right. Boy, baby, snip him out. Don't that fate was great. Listen to you think this is the first time I've been stuck in a piano? <laughs> Here we go. That's what the fuck I'm talking about. I'm just happy your skirt's staying up. No. The map is being delivered tonight, and we have one chance to steal it. Without it, we'll never find the wishing star. The wishing star? It oh. does exist. It does. That star has one wish to grant. One wish. Think of what that could mean for us. Is he going to wish for immortality? See why we needed to hire Puss in Boots in the first place. Uh, because nobody steals from Big Jack Horner. No, not Jack Horner. Don't worry, now. We'll Who's Jack Horner? Probably Big Jack Horner. Very risky. But that wish 
go get me my life's back. We gotta do something about this back. bear. Goodbye, pickles. Oh no, pickles, you're leaving? Perro, start digging. Huh? That'd be hilarious. Oh my god, the animation. DreamWorks just outdoes himself. I still... I used to go back and forth with who I thought had the better animation. Pixar or DreamWorks. I just came to the realization they whoa, they have whoa. different aims. But I think they're they're equal okay, as far as kidding. their Look presentation for what they want to bring. Because it, it's ah, both of them are always doing beautiful. Here? I write rep for luck? I don't need luck for this. I, am I had a person who kept showing up. Pulling up they belly like they got damn Tracy Morgan on me. They would get uppercut. You got it. Huh. Ah. Corner pie. Damn. I pronounce this batch delicious. Big Jack Horner. I don't recognize this character. Sisters got the goods. Whoa. Is it? Is it? The map to the wishing star. Stop it. It all started. Take it to the trophy room. <laughs> he has the weirdest voice for how big he is. Stuff. Yes, I collect enchanted objects, magical icons, baubles, and gigas. Yo, I have a feeling half that body ain't real. You see how his arms. The shrunken ship is that a fusion. Are those unicorn horns? Baby unicorn horns. Half as heavy, twice as sharp. Yo, this dude. Ah, the trinkets. Is nothing disgusting. compared to the awesome power of the magic wishing star. Speaking of which, make with the box, sister. You get with this wish. I will finally be the master of all magic. Hey, Little Jack. Little Jack? It was only a nursery rhyme. Oh, yeah. The lame one. Little Jack Horner sat in the corner eating a Horner pie. Stuck in my thumb, pulled out a plum, and said, what a good boy am I. I don't know this one, magic puppet. but I would clown on it hard if I ever did. What's up, Pinocchio? Jack Horner didn't have any magic. He hmm. was a pathetic, buttered baker's boy. What is he about Little to do? Jack. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. Who's? Look who it is. Who's? I was about to say, is, now, is about your Big Jack Horner not real? Hold up. You promised us our weight in gold. I did. That's the Midas it. Touch, Ever isn't hear it? of the Midas Touch? Aw, oh, cool dibs. <laughs> Dumbass. Oh, I misjudged the situation. <gasps> this is why you don't cross Jack Horner. What is this? Damn. Do you see how much ended up in your can office? I go. Pleasure doing it. Yo, you're gonna sell your own sibling. Goldie. You robbed me. You set me up. You said you were going on some spiritual retreat. No, mm. stick. And you're supposed to be dead. I got better? Ugh, just give us some out. <laughs> I can't believe he nailed down carpet. I want him dead. Talking fairy tale. No! Like, why we gotta keep destroying carpet, though? Mother, yo, she stole his boot from off his foot while he was running. Oof. Oof. Oh! No, 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 no. You shouldn't have done that, Mike. Is that, um, sounds like Ray Winston. This idiot. Ooh, that's a hell of a throw, though. Hey, boys, I found a sandwich in here. I think it's tuna. Right, Perro. Okay, no. Did you call him Pedro? Give me the map. Trust me. Trust you? Like I did in Santa Coloma? Really? Santa Coloma? Si, Santa Coloma. Well, I need the backstory of what happened. I thought they were going to be a, like a couple after the first one. Good people accepting golden gift from Pooh's in first. Yeah. 
Yeah. Curious how he's gonna have to handle this, cause the Bakers does it. Did he attack Mary Poppins? That I probably missed out on. Yo. Get you, my kitties, and your little dog too. I know that is a what? Wizard of Oz reference. This is blank. What the I've hell actually never seen the Wizard of Oz. I've seen the Wiz. Oh. You know, yeah, the black person. I knew was gonna do that. <laughs> yeah, uh, but I've never seen uh, the Wizard of Oz. So maybe that's something I'll watch one day. You let go. A stick? <laughs> what happened to your sword? Got rid of it, you know. Made things too easy. I needed a challenge. Yeah, you look pretty challenged back there. <laughs> There's Damn. no way I'm letting I can hold it. No. Yeah, right. What's your deal anyway? You're wrong with the Chihuahua gang? I don't think so. I don't believe you. That's okay. As long as you believe in yourself. What? Uh. Is he deranged? Yeah. yeah. What's your name? Oh, I've been called all kinds of things. Dog, right. bad dog, stupid dog. Hey, you! You there! Get out! Leave it! Drop it! Big rat, small pig, rat face, butt nugget, small <laughs> brains, you know, that's sort of thing. <laughs> Shit for brains. Really stuck, you know? They legit beat it, too. Like I don't know if I trust this dude. I I, I I feel like he may be nice an assassin. Classic. No one's that dumb. No one's that nice. I don't trust you. Me neither. Yeah. You cannot be trusted. But Yo. I trust him more than I trust you. <laughs> I love how Puss tries. Damn. Like I was about to. Damn. They on some um some old school cowboy shit with this right here. I'm down for this. Yeah, the bearded stroker is crazy. I don't trust him. That was great. This must be the dark forest. I'd say that's a safe bet that that's possibly true. Ready? One, two, after you. Wait, what? I definitely agree. No! Visually stunning. Come on, Damn. kitty. You've got to trust me. <laughs> wait, 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 what's what's going on with his eyes? Oh, they're getting bigger. Oh, kitty. You I didn't believe him. cats did eyes. this really? you told until I kids? got one. And oh, yes. Look at her. Wait a second. Oh, he's. Oh, oh God. No. With the oh, bullets? no. Come on. With the head. Oh, it's no. So, so Can we look at the map now? Uh, Why did he leave a mark Follow like this that? He says we must go through the valley of incineration, over Undertaker Reach, through the cave of lost souls. Really? Let me take a look. I'm down for all this. I just want someone to die. What? Swamp of infinite sorrows, mountains of misery, okay. the abyss of eternal loneliness. Y'all have done some fucked up stuff in your past. Different terrible path for everyone. It's almost like the forest doesn't want anyone to make a wish. Can I try? Watch this be some rainbows and daisies and shit. Mine says, oh, we skip through the pocket full of posies. What? Then drift down the river of relax. Okay, so. fair. Why does he get the good one? Apparently, he is just good and innocent, so. I take it back. Clearly, he, he, he has no evil in him. You hold him up. Really? But don't you cross me. It's a double cross. I'm telling you, no, he is evil. I can't, I can't, I can't roll my tongue like that. Oh, I can, okay. I can't tell you. If you say what your wish is and it don't come true. Sorry, oh. birthday wish rules. Oh, come on. Your wish is the roses. Smack. Ugh. Oh. This is stupid. All I smell is shh. 
I hate flowers. I think I've been to too many. You know, they're just me. He's just my wife and I. Every time I smell flowers, it's like there's a funeral nearby. What's your story? My story? Oh, that's what I need to know. Very when I was a pup, me and my litter mates lived with a family. A family full of pranksters. We liked to play hide and seek, and I was always it. Pick on the little guy, am I right? They tried putting me in a packing crate, a dumpster. No Damn. matter how hard they try, I'd always find them. So one day, they get creative, and they put me in a sock. With the rock in it, I gnawed a hole in the sock and I swam to the surface. <laughs> Never found them <laughs> or my litter mate, so I guess I'm still it. <laughs> wow. That is the saddest, no. funny story I've ever heard. Indeed, well, yo. On them. Hmm? Damn, I'm. I feel bad that I trash talked them before. <laughs> Who tried to steal from me? Hey, he remembers us. See who? X. X. Is it? Is the stone still connected? Yeah, I couldn't get this rock off of it, but it's still pretty cool, right? He's gaining. Yo, okay. he's strong as hell. You don't have to take. Oh. Yes. Was it prepared for that? Locust, defoliate, fly, and feast. Eat those flowers. I'm not a magic locust. I'm not a locust at all. What are you then? Some sort of demon grasshopper? A deadly fairy? Put a spell on I the thought it was Jiminy Cricket for a second. I cast spell. I, I judge you. I sit on your shoulder and judge your actions. No, it's a conscience. It may be Jiminy Cricket. I'm your conscience. <laughs> he wants it gone. Get this, get this shit you thing off of me. He's like a fever in my face. Hold on. It's the great posing the face I haven't seen since. Hey, Santa Coloma. Ah, yes. What Santa happened Coloma. there? Your wish. You mean my wish. You mean my wish. Oh. I've got a plan. I really feel like they did go for a little bit of uh, into, uh, into the Spider Verse. Steady. Ooh. Ooh. What the hell? What? What happened to him? <laughs> so that's what they do. Cool. No, not cool. Oh, you shot me. Ah, the sights off. What are they turning into? My dad. Yeah, he just destroys Push whenever he's remotely near. I mean, Push is gonna have to fight this dude at some point. Indeed. He's running for his life. He's just no good. He's about to have a goddamn heart attack fucking with this wolf. He legit needs a comfort dog. Plus, you do need him. Thank you, Berito. I feel like he's about to drop himself to a damn you, heart attack. Chris? You should tell Kitty. She would understand. No, 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 no. She cannot hear enough of this. Okay. Oh. He doesn't. He doesn't want to be vulnerable Kitty to her in any way. And Tacoloma was in the highest Berito. It was a church. The priest. Oh. And guests. They were going to get married. I Everything thought they was together. But me. I ran away then, too. Oh. Oh. Did he leave? Oh. Yeah. You left her at the altar? Yeah. I know. I am ashamed. I just wish I hadn't hurt her so badly. I regret that day. Imagine. I feel a bad because you, you, you know where this is going. Well, She's going to betray these men. Love. Puss in Boots is not supposed <laughs> to be afraid. But outside that church in Santa Coloma, 
That was the first time I ever felt fear. So mm. I ran. He's being honest. It, it was a mistake. It's a wedding dress. Puss, it's okay. I didn't show up either. Damn! Wait, think bug. Do I wait for the cats to steal the map and then kill them? Or do I just kill everybody all at once? Yeah, you know, he is the ugliest the of a life. fucking no. I mean, I thing love these ever. Guys. He is really Next just... Loose, it... I need a solid surface. God good no damn. There's good. Which oh, is? Well, what's that? All of the magic in the world. For me, no one else gets any. Is that so much? Yes! Yeah. Agree to disagree. All right. Well, you know what they say. Can't bake a pie without losing a dozen men. <laughs> oh. Oh. Yo, his That's hair horrible. and ears are... Your wish is horrible. You're horrible. <laughs> <laughs> Why is Honey so goddamn <laughs> sick? I'm concerned if this dog gets it. I do believe at the end, Goldie's gonna realize that these bears are her family. Ole! That defies all logic. Yeah. That's what I was thinking. Is the puppy alive to all of this? I hate when your question gets answered like a half second Get after you ask it. Don't worry. We can stop. Boys, watch out. What? Damn. Is that going to make him look into himself? Because if it is, that's a cool ass way to have him do that. He's gonna have to confront himself. Hey, good looking. Yes, you know what? I love you guys. So you are my former lives. Reflections of the good old days. Okay. But what is your favorite beer That was an amazing transition. Keen friendship. Ugh. No, that is a crap name. Yeah. Where, where, where's, where's the workshop, Bean? Oh, them want to eat him. I do not. I just want to pet him with my teeth. Stop thinking about your belly, baby. In fact, stop thinking, Pip. Why would I listen to a porridge stealing orphan like you? You're not even a bear. Ding. <laughs> I'm more of a I bear. I love how the dogs are. instigate. She got you. You're nothing but a low rent Cinderella. Oh, Damn. That's rich You're a daft, fat, slow thinking, no reading, Lyme disease, flea ridden, dingleberry bear. Boom. I haven't got dingleberries. No, no. You, you do have them. She destroyed Oi, him. Up, you little bit of <laughs> I'm in the mix now. Okay, okay, here we go. You're all a bunch of knuckle dragging, honey scrounging, grub <laughs> oh, fish. I'm, I hate to say it, I think I like I this dog. He did what 3PO like couldn't do. Mm. Got me to speaking from, from hating to, to loving. Damn. No, we said no crime back. No, Ooh. Yo, is, is he really up in here just samba? I mean, my thing is, even if he gets his lives back, if he goes against that wolf, that wolf is going to take the lives away anyway. He has to be more. He has to evolve. I mean, I feel like the only way he can beat this wolf is with help. He cannot solo this wolf. You will always live a life of you i do love the smell of fear it's intoxicating it is damn sorry to crash the party with <laughs> your past deaths as i like to call them. 
I was that technically is true. All of, all of them. It's frivolous. And. But. Because Boozing Boots laughs in the face of death. Right? He Is he legitimately the Grim Reaper? Now. You are nobody hunter. You are death. And I don't mean it metaphorically or rhetorically or poetically or theoretically or in any other fancy way. I'm death. Not even Straight specifically? Up. I find the very idea of nine lives. This is a terrifying villain. Absurd. And you didn't value any of them. So why don't a point. Do us both a favor and take this last one now. now. That's kidding. Hmm. Don't tell. Run, Boots and Boots! Magnum Go ahead, run! Firing makes it more fun for me. I, I, I do like how this villain has significantly realistic points. If Puss had a value in his life, Death wouldn't be chasing him so, so aggressively. I mean, it's really interesting. The best villains are the ones who speak truth. Where is he going? He's running for his life. I mean, either way you look at it, it's still a postponement. Let's say he gets this wish and he gets his lives back. If he's as reckless as he was before, he'll lose those lives and they'll just piss off Death even more. Like right now, I feel like Death is just on a, eh, I'm gonna get you, but you know, I'm, I'm, I'm enjoying the hunt. If he gets these lives back, I feel like Death's gonna hunt him down with no breaks. What is it, eh? What's your just right? What's so blasted important that you've got us stranded in this haunted forest? I'm getting a family. That's what a proper family. Ooh, then you already everything had will one. Be just right. Hmm. I knew it. Called it. I was always afraid it was too good to last. And whether you think we're your family or not, if this is something that will make you happy. We'll get you that wish. Come on, boys. Damn. Oh, ho, ho. What a good They're even boy, more in her I? family than she ever counted. I mean, you didn't show up to the wedding either. I'm just saying. Giddy, death is after me. What? I've been called a lot of things, but never death. I like it. I want someone to take a brutal death. I know I'm asking for too much, but cartoons do have brutal deaths. You don't believe me? Go watch Bambi. You don't believe me? Go watch Beauty and the Beast. Gaston ain't deserve to die like that. What is that doing to her? Yo. Bust you up, Plum Fum, and then I'm gonna wear your That was weird. It was. <laughs> Baby! Goldie, you gotta make a choice. Really gonna let him have the wish? Blow up already. Soft boss. Uh, yeah. Bow. Yes. Okay. God damn it! Why couldn't it have like Maybe took an arm off or something? To... Oh, I shouldn't have telegraphed it. Why did I just realize whose voice that is? That's uh, the that comedian. Um, damn it! I can't. Remember. His like, his name's just yeah, completely whiffing off this. of my goddamn brain but... right now. If it's wow. really special, maybe one life is enough. I, I, I'm so confused. Like, is this dog evil? Huh? What is that? It's death who has arrived. Who wow. Is, that? is it John Mulaney? 
But it's done. I'm, I'm, I'm getting names all confused now. That's a dope ass shot. Fight. He brought your sword. Pick it up. Go on, pick it up. I mean, <laughs> why did we keep seeing the dog? Yeah. Life's flashing before your eyes? Actually, no. No. Just one. I'm done running. Fear me if you dare. Yeah. Okay. Let him know, boss. I'm talking about. Mm. He beats you. No one's ever beat you. Give him, give him the, give him the respect he deserves. Not even flinching. <laughs> you know we will meet again, right? See, sí. hasta la muerte. That was that was so dope. Magic snacks. Oh no. Oh, was that the cookie from um for a second I would come out naked, but my clothes grew too. That's the cookie from um Alice in Wonderland, right? Please don't make that wish. Please. Please. What what are you doing? Please. Seriously, are you having a hernia or something? <laughs> oh. They're such pools of vulnerability. <laughs> so cute. <laughs> Woo! Yeah, that that is horrible. Yeah. What have you done now? Yeah. The map. My wish. Go, go, go. Oh shit, is it gonna suck him in? Hey, 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 you looking for something? Consider this my resignation, mister. God damn it, I wanted him to cuss at him a little bit. Oh, that's your ass. What did I do to deserve this? What I did you specifically? Let's pick one out for you. Yeah. Oh, what about Chiquito? <gasps> Chumper. Chumper? What do you think, Perrito? Chumper. No. What I got the it. Hell I got is it. How about Jeff? Jeff? Yeah. Jeff? He doesn't have a Jeff's face. <laughs> you know, if it's the same to you, I think I'll just stick with Perrito. I kind of like it, since that's what my friends call me. Then I'm disappointed with the heartfeltness. You know, to be honest, Jumper is pretty good. Yeah, the heartfeltness, I felt something. Keep your workshop in it. <laughs> I, I don't like y'all trying to break through my heart of hatred and dismay. Son of a bitch. I want this vacation to be perfect. 
Did you remember Koopa? My captain oh, Pat? No. Yes, Goblin. And your captain. He kicked the shit captain out of that pigeon. And your captain. My boat! Put and put! How did he know? Oh my god. Team friendship? We did not agree to this. Yeah, we had it anyways. Off to find new adventures. I hear the Shrek music. To see some old friends. God damn it! Are they in here? Is that setting up a Shrek? Alright, so that was Puss in Boots, The Last Wish. I love that movie. I did not find it as funny as the first Puss in Boots, but I do feel that overall it had a better story. I way more was I was way more involved in the story. Um, John Mulaney when I when I realized it was John Mulaney, I could not unhear John Mulaney. That man has a voice that when you recognize it's him, god damn it is it him. But this I think this might be my my favorite Antonio Banderas uh um role. Which is crazy because I love Desperado. Like it's so violent. I love Desperado, but I think this role is just his, man. I, I will, well, like, even more than Zorro, which is crazy. Um, Puss just fits him so well. But let's go down some of the things that I loved. I, I really loved, once again, I loved Puss. I love how Puss had to go through this journey to realize, yeah, he was what he was. He doesn't have to be anymore. He doesn't need his nine lives to be someone important, to be a legend. He was able to figure that out. I loved how death was chasing him because of what he wanted to be. That that really, that was really in-depth to me. I, I really enjoyed that. So, so that was really good to see. I, I really don't have any qualms with this movie. Selma Hayek as softballs, you know, Selma Hayek crushes it and everything that she's in. My only, I've only had a problem with Selma Hayek in one thing, ironically, and that was Eternals, even though I've grown to love Eternals. Um, the way she says Thanos, for some reason, just irks me. It sounds sexy and irritating at the same time. But she, I, I, I liked her character's play in this whole movie, the fact that, you know, um, Puss left her at the altar when she left him at the altar as well. Like neither of them showed up, so I, I, that's my one. That's my one gripe with this movie. That's what she held on him when she didn't show up herself. But uh, outside of that, I, I love those two dynamic. Um, the dog whose name I don't even remember. That was a weird and interesting character because I could not get a grasp on if it was good or bad. I think I flip flopped like four or five times. In the movie, even towards the end, I wasn't convinced that it wasn't going to be. You bought all this. I just wanted the wish. I, I mean, I wouldn't be shocked if someone came to me and said, "Did you know there's a secret end credit where he actually does turn and murders both of them?" <laughs> That'd be funny as hell. I am mad that they showed Puss going back to far, far away. So he's going to see Shrek. He's going to see Shrek and Donkey. Is that? Like a lead-in to a potential new Shrek movie? Because that'd be cool. See Puss come back and he just wants to chill with his old friends where his last life and relax and be cool. Maybe he has kids. Maybe him and Softballs has kids. And they have a weird-ass dog uncle. You know? Like, did they adopt him as a pet? Mm. But, hey, you know, I, I, I need to figure out who played the wolf. I'm looking that up right now because I really want to know who played that wolf. Because that wolf was pretty cool. Okay, some guy named Wagner Mora. I'm not familiar with you, but you did an amazing job as the wolf. Like, I love the voice. I love the tone. Like, you could feel the fear that Puss gave off. And I think part of that was the tone and the voice he decided to use. So, excellent job once again. Um, to Wagner Mora. You did a wonderful job as Wolf. Um, f funny enough, when I look at the rest of the cast, I don't really recognize a lot of the names in here. Um, yeah. It's kind of weird. 
Ray Winston was was Papa Bear. I could see, I I know that voice. I've known that voice for years. So that that didn't get me. Samson Ko was Baby Bear. I'm not familiar with you, but you did a really good job with uh, Baby Bear as well. I, I for I, for a little bit I thought it was. But yeah, he did really good with that. Uh, looks like the dog's name is actually Perito. Am I saying this right? Perito. Um, but Perito, who was voiced by Harvey Gillian, you did a good job of confusing me. I didn't know if you were good, bad, and I kept flip flopping. So that was cool. I, I'm happy that I called that Goldie. That Goldie was going to realize that the Bears were her family. Um, I never realized that she was an orphan. I, I never caught that from from the actual... Uh, I never caught on to that from the old nursery rhyme. So that was crazy. But for me, this movie gets a big thumbs up. If I'm, if I'm going to rate it out of a 10, I'm giving this movie an 8.5. Yeah, it didn't hit me on the comedy level like the first one did for me personally. But I felt the story. I felt the emotions of what Puss was going through way more. Um, but let me know. What, have you seen this movie? What have you thought about it? Did you believe that the dog was good the entire time? Or did you think they were evil? Did you flip-flop? I'm curious on your opinion on that. Please let me know. And hopefully we get a new Shrek movie that's better than 3 and 4. That could be the real tri uh, trilogy killer. Well, bam. The real trilogy kickoffer. The real trilogy ender? What am I trying to say? I don't know. It's late. I need to go to bed. I got a big day tomorrow watching Star Wars. Uh, episode 6. But yeah, but yeah, we're going to go ahead and end this video now. I'm really happy that I watched this movie. Hopefully we get more Shrek-related stuff in the future. Maybe Eddie Murphy will get his donkey movie he's been talking about. But we'll see you in the next one. Looney out.